Hi, my name is Andrea and I'm a caregiver for my mom. My mother is currently suffering from dementia, otherwise known as memory loss, along with other illnesses. I use my channel to share tips, share strategies, information, share my experiences with you as I go through and learn about caregiving. No two days are the same. Hence, I find it very important that we have a community around caregiving. My channel is geared towards persons taking care of their loved ones and also persons who are caring for others professionally as a job. And I invite other persons who wish to come on and share with me their experiences with caregiving. Thanks again for watching, for subscribing, for liking, and for leaving your comments. I really appreciate you. Thank you. Hello, my YouTube family and friends. Thanks again for watching, spending the time to watch one of my episodes in my caregiving series. I'm indeed grateful. And thanks for helping me to build my YouTube channel. Today I reflected and realized that in the coming week, mommy would have been living here with me for two years. So I'd be two full years giving care for her. I'm just reflecting over the period and realizing the journey that we have gone through and just reflecting at where she was when she came to me and where she is now and you know I have seen decline I've seen decline serious decline in her memory but I am not giving up I'm not yielding I'm still praying for her and that God will work in her situation and I'm trusting him to do what he does best I can't do it so yes I realize that her brain cells are probably going but I serve a God who is able and this reminds me of a song that I have been singing all week it says I'm just gonna tell you the words it says Christ is my firm foundation the rock on which I stand when Everything around me is shaken. I've never been more glad that I put my faith in Jesus because he's never let me down. He's faithful through generations. So why would he fail now? He won't. No, he won't fail. And I'm firmly believing that even though the situation is what it is, I am firmly believing that God is still working in her situation. So for the past two weeks, I had a friend visiting, a very close family friend, you can call her a daughter. Um, she has, has a young baby and I saw, you know, just the care and the attention that mommy gave this baby. So every time he cries, she would say, he's crying, you know, he's crying. And, you know, it's just how, how she lights up when um, he was around and her whole maternal instinct um, kicked in. So she didn't forget that. And, you know, for that, I'm giving God thanks. I'll share a little clip of her holding the baby. This is mommy and O'Brien. Hanging out with his cute little booties. What do you want to tell O'Brien, mommy? Just bless him, Lord. Cover him with the blood of Jesus. Amen. Lord, cover him, Lord. Bless him. Oh, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And although he's no longer here with us in this house, you know, she she's she has remembered him she did remember him and she said oh my goodness he's gone 
you know so i'm giving thanks because mommy can't even remember what she, if she had dinner like just now she won't be able to remember what she had for dinner so i'm still giving thanks that you know little things are still happening for her and i'm treasuring those moments and i just had to share it with you and i know we are here preparing for the holiday the christmas holiday we have put up lights and I, I know every time she see the lights it brightens her up and I, I am thinking of what are the other ways that I could brighten her up for Christmas just to make her just to give her a special Christmas I think I know what we're gonna do but that's a secret for now so um, again I just want to tell you thanks for watching um, I'm, I'm happy that you're here helping me, you know, just going through this, this journey. It's not an easy journey. It's, it's a burnout situation. And if you allow life to get you down, then um, you will be burnt out. I just want to take this time for all of those persons who are getting ready for Christmas. Just to be safe. Shop wisely. Take care of yourself and take care of your loved ones. Love you. Have a beautiful, beautiful weekend. Goodbye.